I'm going to show you how to post your time for the St. Pat's virtual road race. You'll receive an email from RacePro and by clicking on the link in that email you'll arrive at this page where you'll be prompted for a username and password. Those are again included in that email as well so fill them in and log in. Uh, successful login will bring you to the input dashboard um, where you will have to put in a posting code. Posting code is a personal code that each and every competitor has. It's different, it's unique, so you'll have to put that in there. It's included in your email as well. Once you put that in there and click the search button, it'll arrive at your dashboard. Um, and there's three main areas that you want to take a look at. Now you can do this on a phone. I'll resize this to show you what it'll look like on a telephone if you do do it on that. So you can use it on your mobile. Um, this is the desktop version. So the information area here has your name, distance, age, category, gender, and bib number. Here you can download your bib number and print it off if you like. It's just a PDF. Uh, then you have a change distance option. So you can change the distance if you like or if you need to correct your age category or your gender you can do that there as well. So say Brianne wants to change to the 5k we hit the change button. We select yes from that required drop down. Then we search in the next drop down for the 5k and her correct age category and gender. We make sure all looks good and we hit the change your distance button. And you'll see that the distance has been changed. She's now doing the 5k. So at this point you're ready to post your time. Now if you don't have to do any kind of changes, all you got to do is post your time. So hit the post time button and here you have one last chance to go back and change your distance if you'd like and here we just entered your actual time so if we're doing 5k in 3512 we put in 00 3512 so in the hour field you can put in 00 to 02 in the minute field you can put in 00 to 59 and in the second field you can put in 00 to 59 so we also have an option to upload a screenshot of your activity app from your phone. Um, if you'd like to do that, you just basically choose the file. You should be able to browse it on your device, select your screenshot, and it'll attach itself and upload it to us. So now you can just post your time. It'll be returned back to the dashboard where you see your time. You'll notice that the change button and the time post button are gone because you can only post your time once. Should you have accidentally made an error, you can contact us at this email us link down here and we can fix you up. Hope you have a great run and take care and stay safe.